G'day. Good morning from Padia. I uh, hope everyone's well. Friday morning, I'm on Third Road in Padia. I'm going to have a look at Millennium Tower, new condo building, some units for sale, and just a massive shout out and thank you to those that have bought, bought me a coffee. So here's the foyer at Millennium Tower. It's very fancy. It smells beautiful in here. And I don't think it's those flowers. Okay, first condo in Arcadia Millennium. And We'll have a look at this. Ah, oh. hey guys. Morning. Just relaxing Nanu. here. Just relaxing here in this. Fancy seeing you here. Yeah. Nice, just in the Arcadia Millennium Tower here. In the oh, showroom. Well. All jokes aside, <laughs> tell us about this place. <laughs> yeah, we're at the Arcadia Millennium Tower, guys, which is a... Um, they're the developers who are going to build the tallest building in Padilla which we're going to see later. Okay. And we're here in a, currently in a showroom, which is a 29 square meter, one bedroom. A little bit of a shoe box. Yeah, we know how much you guys love shoe boxes. Yeah. We haven't done a shoe box in a while, right? <laughs> no. Have we? So what'd you say? 29 square meters? 29 square meters, yes. Okay. Seems nicely. Finished. It looks like actually you went there too. It's the project called ACS. It's the same the develop same developer. Yeah, okay. Smell is amazing as usual. Yeah. I don't know how they do it the developers. Yeah. <laughs> there has to be Whenever like Whenever Manu and I come to these new developments, they they just um they make them just smell so good. Well, you saw the lobby already, right? Yeah, the, the lobby is amazing. That was amazing. Lights. It's a queen size bed, not a king, but that's all right if it's just one of you. Yeah. Or even two. Nothing wrong with a queen size bed. Balcony is also a solid size, though, for a shoebox. That's uh, it. Uh, I'm not just yeah, just like ACS. Uh, it comes fully furnished, but without the electronic appliances. Okay. So no microwave. No fridge. Yeah, no fridge, no washing machine. And look at that So this is really fairly central in Padia, isn't it? Yeah, we're on uh, Third Road. Yes. But yeah, actually, just if you take that road here, yeah, it'll take you about three minutes, I'd say, with a bike. To, to get, get to into Central, Central Walking Festival Street or something. Walk, yeah, yeah. Okay. Location is really good. Actually, you can see Scopa Gabbana, Riviera Ocean oh, right yes. there in the back. Okay. You can see how close we actually are to the city centre. And how much is a one bedroom like this? Uh, they have a promotion right now, actually, and it's 2.9 million. Okay. Up. And. 2.9 million. 2.9 million baht, how much is that? 29, 000, 29 square meters. 29 square meters, yeah. So it's 100,000 per square meter. Yeah, about 100,000, yes. Yeah, actually 100,000, yeah. And do you guys rent any properties in here? Yeah, we rented out one recently for 19,000 baht. 19,000 baht? Yeah. For something like this? Yeah, it's a one, it was a one bedroom too, but also it depends on if you put washing machine in there. Oh, and yes, of course. Stuff. Okay, so um, I think 19,000 baht must be, well, number one, it's a nice building. We haven't even seen the facilities yet. Yeah, we haven't even seen but it. But it's the location. Yeah, location. Must, must have. It's the location, yeah. Okay. They're actually really good at locations, this developer. So we'll go and have a look at... The other layouts? The other layouts. The other layouts. Let's go. 
Okay. I'm going to look at a one bedroom executive suite. Yeah, a bit bigger. We went from 29 so square meters up to 37.84. Yeah, 37 square meters. At least bigger, right? We're mm. not at the 20 square meters and stuff now. This is also a one bedroom. This one's better. Well, that's fancy. Versace. <laughs> I think here is where you really notice the difference. In the bedroom. Oh, yeah. If you take a step in there and then go to the left, you'll see that extra oh. right? You can actually see the Buddha hill from here. Oh, Jesus. You get that? Just trapped oh, on the strips. slippers. <laughs> there. The Buddha hill. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we see the, that's yeah. the vision there. We can go in on the balcony and have a look, huh? Yeah. Watch Sorry. out for the slippers. Sorry. <laughs> Too focused. Neat. They actually have tinted glass for the window. Just yeah, I can see that. Okay. So that's Pratimac up the top of the hill there, Buddha. Yeah. See the vision there and all the other projects. Okay. What, what There's also sea view units available for people. And just out of interest, <clears throat> Manu, what sort of price is this one, this size? Uh, this one, this size is 3.7 million baht. Okay. So also about 100,000 baht per square meter. Yeah. Right. So we'll move on to a um, next layout. And yeah. It seems small, 42 square meters for a two bedroom. We thought it would be unique to show. Yeah. We thought it would be really unique to show. So it's a two bedroom, one bath, right? Which maybe, maybe let's say you were working like um, online, you're, I don't know, stock trader, crypto trader, <laughs> right? So you need an office place, uh, office space. So you can take one of these bedrooms and turn it like to, into an office without having to pay like the price for a full two bedroom. Yeah. You know what I mean? I think Manu is just trying to get the point across that um, if you wanted to have your own separate bedroom and a separate office to do your digital nomad work or stock trading or yeah. even if you had a guest or you're a single parent, um, it's not a bad option. It's quite a good layout to be Because if you honest. pay for a normal two bedroom, yes. you know, prices would be very expensive. Yeah. And here's basically the master bedroom, just like all the other bedrooms that we saw already. Yeah. Yeah, look at that. But you know, it's unique to show. You know, What's that? Yeah, this one. Maybe get to so show, unique. you know, for some people. Mm. Oh, really? Bottega Gold, jeez. What do you think, man? You haven't even been on the balcony. Oh yeah, so of course. Oh, well, balcony is quite similar. All the balconies that we've seen so far are you all like the same. The you like balconies, don't you? I love balconies. Um, okay. Price? Price is 4.2 million. Around 100,000 baht okay. per square or more. So 42 more. square meters, 4.2 million, two bedroom. Yeah, two bedroom, one bathroom. Not bad. Another two bedroom deluxe corner suite. This one's 59 square meters. 
Hey, actually, since you're coming in already, check a, take a look at these doors, man. <laughs> Ooh, you can't even get into the elevator unless you use your face ID. That's proper bulletproof, man. That is one serious, serious door. Yeah, take these, all these locks, man. Jeez. Scorpio, they're good though. Mm. Really good investment. So we're here in this two bedroom, 59. And what I think, I think Jason has the same opinion, but this developer, man, knows how to do the layouts because they feel so big. Yes. So this is two bathroom, right? Yeah. Two bed, two bath, yes. Two bed, two bath. A little bit tight. Yeah, this is probably where they saved some space. But it, yeah, and here's your kitchen area. Where's those, your living area here. Yeah, it's full burner, hot plate, range hood, full size fridge. This is um, quite nice and spacious. And the balcony actually, Jason, mm. it's absolutely massive, right? Looks huge. It does. Oh, you even have some ghost tower views from here. <laughs> so when Manuel says the ghost tower, which we've kind of talked about in the past, it's that big tall building there that never was completed. Waterfront. The waterfront. Bailey High Pier. Was supposed to be the most expensive project. Was it? What I've heard. Really? Yeah, but then, yeah, you know, traverses. This is your second bedroom. Still a good size. If you compare it to like other projects. Oh, yeah. like, like, uh, we were talking we won't off mention camera. any names, but. Yeah, we were talking off camera. There's one project where it was a two bedroom and we could barely like yeah, fit it. in here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, exactly. But you can easily walk past here, right? Mm. To the other side of the bed. Not even fat side just got through. No <laughs> problems. And here's your master bedroom. This is what I like, man. Woo. See that glass? Mm. It's, it's a pro and a con. Is this you pulling out in your Ferrari? A 458? Yeah. Should be me, man. <laughs> <laughs> We always dream. It's all good. After dream, right? Definitely. Yeah. Um, so 50, 59 square meters, so is it 5.9 million? It is actually 5.9, yes. And you have an ensuite in your master bedroom. Stay in the shower. I like these darker tone colors. I like dark gray here. Dark well, it's, I, I like it because it's a nice, this matte black, it's a nice change from chrome, especially with the dirty water here. It yeah. tends to. Also, the tiles, you know, easy to maintain. I think they're, they like um, built the showrooms to be masculine, I'd say. Right? Mm. Okay, 5.9 million. Yeah. Two bedroom deluxe corner suite. Ooh, <laughs> 70, deluxe, man. 72.59 <laughs> square meters. Yeah, that's two bedroom here that we can show you guys. Oh, wow, look. This living is room li feels huge, right? It's living rooms. They're really smart at making layouts, man. They put their dining area here on the side, in the showroom. Obviously, you can. Maybe yeah, put move it, it around, there, whatever yeah. you want to do. Then you have your Jack and Jill toilet. Okay, yep. You can enter to the Got bedroom it. here. Yep. Or just if you're a guest, from this yep. side to this bathroom. Come through that way. It's the guest bedroom here. It's a big bedroom. Yeah. Feels like the size of the master bedroom from the last one we looked at. Oh, it right? does. And what's nice in here is that the uh, all of your bed, both of the bedrooms have a balcony access. That's good. Uh, so you can just this and get get out. Nice. 
I'm loving the AC right now. Yeah. <sighs> we had a, a lot of rain late yesterday afternoon and, late, and last night, which yeah, was nice. Yeah, last night was brutal, mm. the rain. And I, my, my girlfriend's nephew ordered some grab too. In so the, the rain? Yeah, so the poor driver had to drive. Oh, but we tipped him like 200 baht to just to make it up for it because he actually <laughs> went. Yeah, it's difficult for those riders in the, in the heavy rain. <laughs> we felt so sorry for that guy. <laughs> actually, guys, you, you can see the sheer size of this balcony, man. Yeah, just show it. So if you're sitting out here, you, you may not have the air conditioning on inside, but it's a, it's a good sized balcony. It's a really good sized balcony. You want to enter yeah. to the master bedroom from here? Okay. okay. This is your master bedroom. And you have the ensuite bathroom here. give you a bit of an idea of the location. You get all the furniture, basically, bed, the built-in, the no uh, electronic appliances. Okay. Besides the AC. Yeah. Mm, it's okay. Nice. Actually, guys, we can show the location approximately from here. Yeah. From the balcony. See that brown building there? That's the Hilton. That's where Central is. Oh, Cent uh, Central Festival's just yeah. there. So that's Central Festival. The base is there. So probably Walking Street will be around here. Yeah. So location is pretty, pretty good. It is. I'm looking forward to seeing the facilities. Are we looking at any more in, in here? Yeah. You okay. can maybe show you. I'll go through the living room. Oh, you go to the living room? But nice, right? It is. And look at the room you've got when you're sitting down. Watching, oh. watching TV. Watching Formula One. Can we just stay here? Formula One in Singapore this weekend. And practice one starts at 4 o'clock or 4.30 this afternoon it's in Taiwan. It's probably going to be Max Verstappen win again. Oh, yeah, I know. I know. As a Ferrari fan, that hurts. <laughs> yes. It's so bad. Okay. You can't do anything. <laughs> we'll, uh, another one? Another? Yeah, we can show you another one. Okay. Now. Yeah, we're just here in the gym, guys, on the 31st floor. The building has 46 floors. Someone asked me about rowing. It's not a full-on rowing machine, but it's not bad. Yeah. This gym is actually properly equipped, man. Think about it. This is proper gym equipment. It's commercial, man. Commercial? Great, right? yeah. So the brand of these? Because the, the owner of the development, he's, he's into fitness. That's why he really puts in good equipment here. And it's huge, right? You have almost everything. Yes. I forgot these uh, treadmills. Amazing. You have your sauna here. Steam room? Yeah. We get in there? No, no, thank you. Here's your sauna. Ooh. But you don't need a sauna in Thailand, do you? <laughs> no, no right? You just step outside. And here's where you go to the pool. Yeah, check this out, man. You have a nice little garden here, also. But, ooh. What do you think about this, Jason? Yeah, 
What do you think about that, man? It's stunning, cool. right? Well, look at the, you got views down John Tian there. Yeah. And Paddy Bay views here, right up to Wongamat. <laughs> exactly. But man, this is awesome. Isn't it? Well, this is definitely going to test out the microphones. Yeah. It's very Quite windy, yeah. Huh? It's windy up here. Look at Manuel's flowing locks in the wind. <laughs> yeah. So this is just a little. Ah, you can area. see the patio sign from here, actually. Yes. Always looks a long way away on camera, but the patio city sign is just over there. This is a really Probably good central here. location if you want a nice new building with yeah. lots of different options. Great facilities. Let's go to the next pool, guys. That's one, that one is going to blow your head away. Okay. Top floor, guys. We're on the 46th floor. Just above us is the helipad. So if you have a, helipad, a helicopter, fly in here. Or there's uh, an emergency. Oh, yeah, there's... or there's an emergency. There's a drone flying around. Good Probably up. can't see it you on camera, right? It. But look at this pool view, man. Woof. Wow. I think there's Walking Street. It is. There, that's Walking Street, yeah. Yeah. So, down that road there. Yeah. All the way to the to end. To the there, end, and you turn Street. left. That's Walking Street. But man, the views from here. Mmm. You can even see the mountains a bit on that side. See Wongamat there. It's Pradumnak, that's Jomtian. That's, that's the thing in Patia. Like I'll show, we show you so many condos and properties, not always with Manu, my good sidekick, but Oof. there are so many condos in Patia, and they're all- Have something unique, right? You're a bit unique. Hey, what, anything to wrap up here? Oh, how much was that last one? That was Oh, 70... the last two bedroom, the 72 square meter was 7.2 million. Well, that makes sense. Yeah, 72 square say, meter, yeah. 7.2 million. Yeah. Cool. But they're actually, one info I have to give out though, um, they're actually sold out of uh, foreign quota. This project is sold out of foreign quota. All right. So. You have to buy it through Thai company. Oh, okay. But we have something prepared from the same developer that is available in foreign quota, where you can still get in before it's sold out. Cool. We going there now? Yeah. Sweet. Let's go. Let's go. Check this out, guys. So currently I have a race car, man. These two white stripes. Whoa. You see these two white stripes? They give me an extra 300 horsepower. Woo <laughs> <laughs> this is man. This is how I get chauffeured around. <laughs> In I have a new company car. I'm gonna check that out. It's got red Brembo calipers. Yeah, it has Brembos, man. And Woo. racing red drums at the back. Wicked. <laughs> okay. Hey guys. We heard Grand Solaire, we're just in the, just in the hallway. Uh, but what we wanted to mention actually, uh, Arcadia Millennium Tower is um, they have a gold promotion. So either you can take that gold promotion or take the physical gold, maybe sell it later on, or give it to your wife as a nice birthday present or Christmas present, whatever you want, or you can upset it of the price of your unit. So that, really that's nice. only for the foreign. That's Sorry, for the Thai, for the that's for the Thai quotas, because I told you guys, okay. there's sadly no foreign quota left. And that's also why we took, wanted to take you guys to Grand Solaire because you want to secure yourself a foreign quota unit, right? So this is like the beginning process of when you can secure the foreign quota here at Grand Solaire. Okay. But they're actually on their last leg now. It's really popular. Um, actually, one of my customers just bought uh, some units here and he seemed to be really happy about it. Yeah, facilities are amazing here. <laughs> You can see that it's going to be the landmark of Paddy. It's on the highest point in yeah. Paddy. And here's actually the board where you can see what's sold already. Okay. All those red dots are sold. So do we want to talk about the model or the, the award here? Yeah, let's show the awards, man. Here's some of the awards from the developer. And these are usually the magazines when you go to an Emirates flight or something, you'll have these magazines to read. Perfectly with the golden wings too, huh? We just talked about the gold promotion. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay, right. so what are we gonna do now? 
You want to look at the showrooms and then take the models at the end? Or? Definitely. Yeah, let's do that.